Hello guys, we are back with the epic horse game, My Horse and Me, and today we are heading into the jumping exercises, because in the next episode we are going into the actual show jumping competitions. So we need to prepare a bit, and I need to show you guys more on how to actually jump with your horse. I showed you briefly in the first episode, but now it's time to actually do the exercises to get to know the game a bit better. And there are six exercises which we will try out today. So let's begin with number one. Now we're going to learn how to jump. If you're going in the right direction, the red flags will be on the right side of the obstacle and the white flags will be on the left. Your horse will take the jump on its own. Concentrate on guiding the horse straight towards the obstacle. So the only thing I need to do for this exercise, which is the easiest one, is to just move forward and the horse will jump by its own accord. Now there's a slight text bug down at the bottom of the screen. And Perfect. of course the horse should not move this slow. Just waiting for the game to realize I finished this. Wow! That was great! Yeah, wow, amazing, I'm such a great rider. Okay, so click space to continue. And I get a new sweater, nice. And we're heading on straight on to next course. To help your horse make a great jump, ride straight towards the obstacle. Jumping through the middle is important. The route marked out on the ground will help you see where to ride. Uh, I guess the horse will be easier to move now, and yeah, it is moving forward easier than in the last exercise. Fantastic! But it's still really, really slow. It's not supposed to be this slow. Perfect! And as I said previously in the last episode, I think this is part of the training, like when you try out these exercises the first time. Fantastic! Everything is so slow just for you to be able to learn how to do it. Nice work! Superb riding! I'm very proud of you! So what sort of reward will I get? Nordic sweater. I just really want the saddle pad. So next course. Your speed is also very important. Too fast and you'll knock off a rail. Too slow and your horse might refuse to jump. Now, let's practice jumping at the right speed so you can avoid a penalty. So the only difficulty here is that the route to obstacle number two might be a bit sharp. So you need to be careful in that turn. So I'm just waiting for the game to tell me that I'm allowed to go. I can cut it off earlier by pressing space or something. Oh, come on, horse, you're moving so slow. And here I now have perfect the opportunity to make an extra gallop, I think. No, I don't. Oh, that sucks. I thought that was the green obstacle thing. Why are you moving so slow, horse? Of course, I can't do anything with the horses moving so slow. So I need to head back to the menu and restart. It's in moving so slow, and I can't really turn at this Fantastic. speed. Fantastic! Because I won't have any... I don't really have anything that will help me to turn. I need... Here we go, now the horse actually is moving. Oh, only at the trot. That's Doing too bad. Great. So just let's take a short turn here. In order to save some time. 
Oh, that's so slow. What's going on here? Excellent. I think that's a bug, really. It shouldn't be this slow. Excellent. I'm so impressed with how well you ride. Oh, thank you. Oh, denim pants. Nice. So, next course. Now you're going to jump an oxer. An oxer has two different elements in a single jump, so you'll make a mistake if you jump diagonally. Let's practice jumping straight. And hopefully the horse will be slightly faster this time, because otherwise this would be very difficult. So I'm just going to press space and get to it. It's Fantastic. like a snail. It's not supposed to be this slow, really. That pole almost fell. Oh, almost being the keyword. I did take that a bit too much on the diagonal. I should have been more straight on. But uh, like, I can't really be bothered now when it's going so slow. Good jump. But I think it will speed up whenever I go into the actual show jumpings. Fantastic! No mistakes at all! Because I have played this game up to the professional league on this PC and it worked out perfectly. So I'm guessing the horse will be way easier to maneuver when I get into the actual competitions. A royal aqua sweater. And the next course. You can improve your overall time by sprinting for a couple of seconds between the jumps. This can help make up for lost time. Let's practice sprinting. So now we can actually use the sprint, which I have been longing for because that helps me move a bit faster. <laughs> so let's try it out. So as you can see down at the bottom left corner of the screen, I have a couple of sprints to use. I have Perfect. two left now. And this is going so slow, something is wrong. So I'm just going to turn here so we can do this a bit faster. Let's take a shortcut. What happens if I sprint here? Not much. <laughs> this is going so slow, this is not supposed to be like this. Fantastic! So one last sprint. That was great! Uh, not really, <laughs> it went so slow. But I think there's only one course left, which should be shortcuts. A body warmer. Is that like a vest? So, let's try the next course. I think that should be shortcuts. The main route is marked to guide you through the course, but you can take shortcuts, as long as you jump over the obstacles in the right order. Yeah, so now we're going to try out shortcuts. I think it's the same op uh, course as last time, but uh, well, we're simply going to take the exact same route as I did in the last episode. Or, in the last course. I should nice know how to work. English by now. So I'm turning here. It doesn't, like, I can't really notice that I made the sprint at all because this is going so slow. Excellent! But I think that shows at the like at the bottom was well, well because like if you look at the time down in the right corner it feels like the seconds are moving way too slow so i think something is wrong with the entire game right now <laughs> i'm going to try to solve Doing that in the great. next episode
Excellent. You, you didn't make any mistakes. Woohoo! So I got a strawberry jacket. Nice. And now we're done with all the jumping exercises. So let's go back to the menu. And for next episode, we are heading into the show jumping. And we'll begin with the beginner league, of course. And by heading in there, we will be able to unlock the amateur league. So I will, in the next episode, do all the beginner class courses in order to unlock the amateur league. And the horse should move way faster by then. It should not move as it has done today because this has been almost embarrassing. I'm like, come on, horse, move faster. Uh, so hopefully it's going to go better next time. If you haven't done so already, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And I really hope I will see you all next time when we head into the beginner league in show jumping.